Hello everybody and welcome to another Jurassic World news video where today we've got amazing news because the teaser trailer for none other than Jurassic World Chaos Theory is out now just literally like minutes ago when I'm getting ready to record this it was released and we're gonna break down everything in it right now very quickly so let's get into it. <laughs> So not much is in this trailer, unfortunately, but it's very likely we will be getting a full trailer in the upcoming weeks or so, along with much more news, and if not so, we'll still be getting loads to talk about. But let's go over what we have right now, and the first thing I want to talk about is Rexy, which is one thing that I was kind of concerned about with this series, if we would get anything on her, because we already know that she is the most popular dinosaur, but it looks like we are going to be getting content from her. As this teaser trailer showcases her very reminiscent of some concept art for Jurassic World Dominion, as those who have been paying attention to the concept art leaked over the last few years for Dominion's concept art, we know that this little sequence of Rexy running away from a helicopter and running into a a main road where a car crash ensues with both cars and trucks and a pile on a power line sorry going sparky sparky we know this is actually inspired from the two pieces of concept art that actually came from Jurassic World Dominion one of which showcases Rexy walking away from what is left of a crashed truck and also of her being caught in some power lines. And this little clip of her showcases both. And one thing is very interesting is actually from the lighting, it actually showcases possibly the return of her scars. This is one thing that was actually kind of a letdown in the first Jurassic World show with Camp Cretaceous, as the question that everyone immediately was asking when Rexy showed up was, where are her scars? Not only her Jurassic Park ones, but of course, her fresh new Jurassic World ones at the time. But it looks like we will be getting her scars this time, as now that they're not fully bloody and gross and new, it's very likely they realize that they can showcase them. Which is why I think personally they didn't do it in the Camp Cretaceous show, as she would have been showcased as very bloody in that show, and I don't think it would have worked for the show's rating, but that's just my opinion. But hopefully it is true from what it looks like, and we will be getting her with her scars. I really hope we get to see a lot of her, and of course, get to see her add to her kill count. And also the ending of the trailer showcases a simple yet awesome reveal that is of course Darius coming out of a truck which glad to see he's learned how to drive and such because well he could have used that lesson in like a few of his situations when riding a gyrosphere for example in Camp Cretaceous let me tell you but he's looking absolutely amazing and as it was stated not too long ago he is in fact looking much older than he did in Camp Cretaceous's season 5 finale which took place at the very end of Fallen Kingdoms events as well which also leaves us to wonder how long has there been between this? Is this going to take place pre-Dominion or is it going to take place post-Dominion? I know the Rexy clip makes it seem that it's pre-Dominion because, well, she's not in the Biosyn Valley, but you never know. There could be something that changes that. Or even the fact that this could be going into both times, but who knows about that yet? And that's it so far, guys. That's all we got to look at. Darius is looking quite sharp and such. No news on whether or not any of the other campers are coming, but if we don't have a trailer or anything soon, I will be going into that as well, along with which Allosaurus is going to be the main Allosaurus, since we've got five Allosauruses, but only one of them can be, and I'm actually working on that video right now. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, that's all for it. Hit the like, join the hunt by hitting the subscribe button and oh my god guys cannot wait for more for this and tell me your thoughts in the comments on what you want to see in this show whatever they are leave them in the comments and i'll see you later Bye bye